Hey, and morning, how you all doing? Um, so today is another beautiful day. I'm rocking my crazy hair look. Um, and we're just going to be removing a rear wheel from the VFR 800. Uh, this is uh, a wheel that failed its MOT. And I'm just going to go through a couple of little things on how I remove it. And um, it's just a quick video on just taking it off. That's it. <laughs> so let's put you guys down there. And very simply, we have got a size 19. And to crack the nuts off to start with, um, you just apply pressure to the foot brake. Um, so you can kind of use like a technique. You can even do it in flip flops. And you can just break it off using that technique. Then you can just take, take the wheels off um, as you would. So a real simple little technique to do that. Um, and then it's just got four, four lug nuts. And then uh, out comes your wheel. And it's, it's that simple. So on this one, the reason it failed is you can probably tell uh, where's a wear limiter. So yes, let's find one. Okay. Okay. So just here. Don't know if you can see that, but there's um, there's the groove, and then there's like a little little notch just here. That's a wear limiter, so it's just approaching the wear limiter on here. And then there's another one, or was it further around? And this one is completely level. And that's why it failed, is because it literally is below the limit. So you don't need any fancy sort of measuring equipment. You can just literally look for these little ridges. And then that shows you that, uh, that your tiny is replacing. So the good thing is, we have got a brand new Pirelli. Oh yeah. Um, which will match up to the front wheel. Um, and in my next video, I'm just gonna be removing removing it. And I'm probably gonna do that indoors because it's a lot more cozy and comfortable. So um, hopefully you enjoy this. Um, take care, have a beautiful day. I know I will. <laughs> See you later, bye. <laughs>